Hey guys, welcome back to another video. In today's video, we'll be I'll be showing you um about a feature in the Recon LX NPM package. So the the feature I want to show you is fetch transcript. So what this feature does is it basically gets the messages and then it converts into a HTML file that looks something like Discord. So let me just show you how to do it. So we need to install this Recon LX. If you don't have Recon LX already, just run npm i recon lx. Okay, make sure your version, your version is 1.0.71 or anything that is um, the latest version. You must get the latest version. So let me check my version. Just go to package.json to check your version. And then you can find Recon LX um, right here, 1.0.71. So it's the latest version. So if you don't have the latest version, just run... Um, npm update recon lx okay it's lagging i think just run this and then it will work so i'll be showing you guys how to use this fetch transcript thing uh, i'm just gonna put it under utils and call this transcript.js so first you're gonna require the package require recon lx Okay, then when you get fetch, um, fetch, trans. okay, so we're gonna fetch transcript and then we're gonna do the basic setup of a command. Okay, it's really lagging right now. I don't know what's going on. Is it because? Um, never mind, I'll just type it manually module exports name will be transcript run async client message arts so we'll be needing um, the discord.js we we'll need the message attachment we need the message attachment and then um, okay, so as you can see in the, as you can see, as you can see here, um, it gives you an, a little example on how to use it. So you can just, let me just scroll down. Okay, so it returns a buffer, so it returns bytes. That's why you gotta use it in new message attachment, and then you can send it to whatever you want. Basically, how you do this is the message, the first parameter message, it gets the um, message of the current channel. So if you do message right here, it will take the channel of the current message. So let me just show you the example. Fetch transcript message. And then the second parameter is about how many messages you want. So I want 10 messages. So I just put 10. And then it's a promise, so it's dot then and then um, data so this is um, the buffer that we're gonna get and then um, const file equals new message attachment and then here you want to put data in it data all right and then the next one you want to put uh, a HTML so you can name this file anything you want just remember you need the .html extension just gonna call this index.html and then message.channel send message.channel send file so we'll be sending the attachment so let's just try this okay so let me just say um, here is 10 messages for so tutorials for videos. Let me just send a random text and then when I run Y transcript Okay Um let's just wait. Um What is going on? Then data 
Okay, so it sends the HTML file, so when I download it, okay, it's taking some time because I'm lagging, I don't know for what reason, oh, but it would send to you pretty quickly. So you just download the HTML file, um, let's just wait for it to download, okay, so yeah, um, if you click on it, don't mind this. You can see the HTML file. The reason this is like this because um, I don't have a um, icon URL here. So if I do it in my in my server, I mean my support server, and I do it right here, I'll just say send some random text. Okay, and when I write transcript. Okay, and then you get the transcript. So when I download it, and then I click on it, it should so it should show the um, icon the icon of the guild. So yeah, this is about it for the. It also shows the time and who sent it and also the picture. So yeah, that's about it for today's video. If you need any help, um, or you know, you just want to hang around in the Discord server, feel free to join the support server. Links will be in the description. If you like this video, leave a like. If you want more content from me and more tutorials um, of the NPM package, make sure to leave. Make sure to hit the subscribe button. It really helps the channel out. Other than that, have a nice day. See you again on the next video. Bye.